Thailand. Oh, so you're Thai and Australian, but you look Filipino, though. <laughs> Uh, well, I think what my my wants to say, bro, is that uh, you have oh, that passion for music that runs in the blood of every Filipino. So uh, that's why a lot of people are relating to your music and loving about it. So uh, I think you know, Kobe as well has a special question for you. Go ahead, so, Kobe. Gabe, since you're a rookie OPM artist, of course our viewers would like to know, to get to know you more. So can you tell us more about yourself? How old are you? And how did you start your music career? Oh, <laughs> what, what type of genre you like lean towards? Uh, in terms of making music or, or yeah. listening? Um, like I, any. Would say, I would say indie pop. Definitely. Indie like. pop. Yeah, yeah. So who are, who are your favorite artists in that genre? Uh, well, I mean, I love Lainey. I know a lot of people in the Philippines do. Yeah. 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 Uh, I don't know. I listen to all kinds of music, though. Like, um, I love Mac Miller. I love Coldplay. You know, mm -hmm. I'm just a huge music fan. Yeah. Wow. Go, yeah. And we also want to know, Gabe, your song "Blue Skies." What's the? What was the inspiration behind it? Yeah. So with my music, we had, a, we had a, a peek at the music video as well, and we saw just the nice awesome shots uh, combined with the song it looked great but uh, so I, I was personally curious because the question I had in my mind when I watched the music video was uh, who who is that girl in the in the music video is that uh, someone special in your life Gabe or is that just uh, a good friend of yours oh no no okay <laughs> that was just uh, part part of the part of the storyline that's all right well what, what was the, the inspiration other than of course that that tough experience you went through behind the music video when you were thinking about the concept what was going through your head um yeah so the video is kind of split into three sections um, kind of shows the deterioration of the relationship over time so you know you got the honeymoon phase the start where everything is right kind of the middle part where it's you know it's okay but it's going downhill and then obviously on one side everything just is chaos and I think a lot of people can relate to that. That's how a lot of relationships go sometimes. But I think it's important to um, have that relatability. I feel like a lot of people can, can relate to And, and uh, that real relatability as well. It's hard to get when you're just 19 years old, releasing music already. But in relations in general, uh, there's a f three words, or in Tagalog, it's just two words that mean a lot, and that's uh, of course I love you. But in Tagalog, it's actually. And even my mic, can you teach Gab as well how to say I love you in, in Tagalog? It's important. Um, I will teach that him later. But before that, I need to ask him since the has the official hashtag today is We Stand Asa. So let me ask you, who are your music idols? Do you know anything, uh, anyone here, like, you know, music artists here in the Philippines? In the Philippines? Um, 